Okay, I'm ready. Put your arm out. No, it's my turn. Hi everyone, Merry Christmas. It is Christmas Eve and we are going to watch Jingle Jangle with our matching pajamas on, courtesy of mom. And um, I'm just down here to make some popcorn right now. We're gonna watch the movie, go to bed, and then I'll wake up tomorrow morning and wrap the rest of the presents that we still have not wrapped. But um, I'm just down here to make some popcorn for our movie. I heard Jingle Jangle is really, really good, so I'm excited to watch it. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Mm. Merry Christmas, Nico. Merry Christmas to you. Come Merry here. Christmas, Mommy. Mm. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Mm. Merry, Christmas. Mm. Merry Christmas, sweetie. Merry Amazing, 
in Christmas times We'll be chilling and having a good, good time Put all your gifts upstairs. No, all right. I was like, ah, because I have a Pikachu. Da 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 da. Ooh. Whoa, new plates. New plates, new silver, and look at these. These are great. A spatula. <laughs> look at this. <laughs> hey guys, so I it is the afternoon and I'm prepping dinner right now. Um, I originally wanted to make Cornish game hens, but uh, they were all out of them at the store. So I got duck. I've never made duck before. We're gonna see how this goes. Um, I am not using a recipe, but I made this, hold on. I made this mm, marinade, rub, whatever that Feels to me like it would taste good. I don't know. I'm just gonna listen to the duck. So, <laughs> uh, it tasted good to me, but um, if you're curious, I'll show you what seasonings I used. So in there is an entire stick of butter, melted, and then, hold on one sec. So the brown sugar, um, I used probably uh, a generous amount of that. Um, slightly less generous amount of garlic powder, and salt-free Italian seasoning. Um, slightly less generous than that would be the onion powder. And then the cayenne pepper and smoked paprika to taste. So I, would, I just like sprinkled in and kind of saw the balance of that and went back and forth with different ingredients um, until I tasted something that seemed like it was gonna work for this. So cross your fingers for me. And oh my gosh, I forgot, I did add salt. There is salt in this uh, mixture as well, so don't forget the salt. That is also just to taste. I would suggest adding that at the end after you kind of get a flavor balance that you think you'd like, then add the salt and then just kind of 
play around with stuff, um, see how it is. If this works out, um, I'll try to develop some kind of um, step by step with a real recipe, but this is my first time making a duck and uh, we'll just see how it goes. Rubbing it all over the skin, um, like they do on TV. Hopefully this is uh, gonna work for us too. And don't forget to remove all the interesting bits from inside, the neck, the giblets, all that kind of stuff. So that's already done. I'm not gonna use stuffing because, um, like I said, I originally had planned to make Cornish game hens and they were all out. So I didn't plan on making any stuffing. So this, we're just gonna cook an empty bird and that's fine. Or maybe it's not, we'll find out. <laughs> okay, so this is one hour in and um, I have it propped up on, I don't know if you can see that little metal thing. Um, I didn't, this uh, roasting pan did not come with a, um, like an elevated metal grate, but I used um, this that I have from a steamer pot. I also did not have any string to tie the feet together to truss it, as they say, but I used some aluminum foil, made a thin strip of aluminum foil and wrapped it around to keep the feet tied together and then put some toothpicks in the wings to keep those together. I don't think it really matters, probably just for presentation, but I just want it to look fancy. So I'm gonna cover this back up. It smells amazing. Um, and it's gonna cook for another hour and 45 minutes. All right, the next thing I'm gonna do now, it's, um, it's almost time to add the vegetables for roasting. So I'm going to, uh, I have these onions and Brussels sprouts that I've chopped up. I'm gonna add some olive oil. Some garlic powder. Some onion powder. And some salt and then I'll just stir to coat everything around make sure it's nice and even all right so I've taken the bird out and I'm gonna add the last uh, ingredient in here the last few ingredients the vegetables for roasting just kind of sprinkle them all around and those will roast and the rest of the cooking will be with the bird uncovered. Get out of here. In these last 10 minutes of cooking, I'm just gonna add some lemons for some aromatics, I guess. And because they look pretty. And here's the final product. Sprinkled some cranberries on it, some dried cranberries and hopefully it looks as good as it tastes. We've got some cranberry sauce over here and then also some mashed sweet potatoes to eat with this. But it looks good. Tastes as good as it looks. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, hope it look, I hope it tastes as good as it looks.
What? I feel like I shouldn't be tearing down this house. <laughs> Dylan has no problem with it. <laughs> it's just so beautiful. Mm. Can we have a to our own little toy? Um, like dollhouse? Because I love dollhouse. A dollhouse that you won't eat? <laughs> I want my, I want, I want us to have our own little dollhouse. Hmm. So Christmas night for dessert. You guys can start the process of demolishing your gingerbread houses that you put so much time and effort into. <laughs> Zia is very uncomfortable with this. <laughs> yeah, I really don't want to. <laughs> Go ahead. There's always next year. <laughs> How's yours taste? I'm taking the balls off because they don't like it. Okay. Good? Oh, turns. Yeah. <laughs> the <laughs> <laughs> so everyone's in bed. The kids are in bed. The rabbits are put up. Matt's in bed watching Mandalorian. I will join him in a few minutes, but I'll probably fall asleep right after because I'm exhausted. Um, but we had a great day. I hope you had a great day too. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope everyone had a very Merry Christmas. Thank you and I will see you next time. <laughs>